ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರುವಶಿಪಾಸಿಂಧುಪೇಭ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೇಭ ವೈಷ್ಣವೀಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ್ ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ಬಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ವೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವಿ ಕೇಶವಸ ಸ್ನಭಕ್ತಿಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸ್ವತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚೈವನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರುಣ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನ ಭವಿಷ್ಯದೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದಂ ಶಿವಭಿರಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ವೇತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲ್ಯಭವಾದ್ದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾಶಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಮಿ ಗೋಧೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶಿ ಪುರುಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸ್ವಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಂ ಕರುಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕ ಬದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನ ಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಶುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರು ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ಬಂಧಿ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪಂ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿತ್ತ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣೋ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗು ಮದಾಪಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ಯ ಬದನಿ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಜಸ್ ಭಕ್ಷಿ ಜಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಭೀತ್ ಶಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜಿ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
एवं प्रकृति वैचित्रा भिद्वते मतयो नीनम परम पर जेन के सांचित पसन्न मतयो अपरे एवं प्रकृति वैचित्रा भिद्वते मतयो नीनम एवं प्रकृति वैचित्रा भिद्वते मतयो नीनम परम पर जेन के सांचित पसन्न मतयो अपरे गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत तो सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत तो सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमंश जगतगुरु टोल दोज हुआ एलिवेटेड पर्सनैलिटी इन आवर सोसाइटी इन ट्रू सेंस दे बिकम ए टार्गेट ऑफ अटैक ऑफ कॉमन पीपल और दोज हुआ मेकिंग पॉलिटिक्स दे लाइक टू फाइट गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्री श्री भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपा परमंश जगतगुरु टोल्ड दोज हुआ एलिवेटेड पर्सनैलिटी इन आवर सोसाइटी इन आवर कंट्री दोज हु लाइक टू डू समथिंग गुड फॉर आदर्स यूजली दे बिकम एन अटैक एन ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ अटैक इफ यू आर गोइंग टू enjoy popularity name fame if your efficiency your activity is very very high then you can automatically catch the attention of other people those who are envious with you they can fight with you they cannot allow you to go up anywhere be in political level be in educational level sports level job level Anywhere you go, this kind of situation you will have to meet. Those who are elevated, they become an, an object of attack because they like to do something good. That is why Bhagwan Sri Krishna wanted to give one nice example to Uddhav Ji Maharaj. I think in Kartik Bhutwa I already discussed. Bhagwan Sri Krishna speaking to Udhav. Udhav, one day one small bird is going to find one piece of flesh, going to get, and going to take it, and going to fly to a very peace, very nice place, solitary place, where nobody can disturb, and. that bird planning to enjoy that piece of flesh but in the meantime when the small bird going to fly with the piece of flesh then all other vulture all dangerous bird they are going to then to chase to kill then the small bird thinking i have nothing not i have done nothing wrong to them why they are going to attack me Eh? What wrong I have done? In the meantime, the small bird was very afraid, and from his brick, the piece of that you know flesh dropped down. Then immediately the small bird watching, well, they are all birds. Yeah, first of all they plan to kill me. They are running towards that. Piece of that flesh. Then the bird thinking, "Oh, I was not the reason. I was not the you know object of attack. Attack is that piece." In our society, even in spiritual society, if you are going to get some la puja patistha in true sense, suppose, then. you will have to face different kind of controversy fighting you have to face it's a must even bhakti mr thakur even sila bhakti siddhant saraswati goswami thakur even kesab goswami all all their history so what to speak about sila ramanuja charya i can come to the point it's quite natural if you want to bring some evolution in this society want to do some good 
then automatically you are going to catch attention of other people, they are going to fight with you. The sloka I started with is very important sloka, Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking to Tom. Evam prakriti vai chitrat bhiddhate matayo ninam. Due to the diversity of your nature, um, nature of Jivatma, your nature is different, her nature different, your nature different, my nature different, or different, different nature. According to previous answer, it's a must. Evam prakriti vai chitrat. According to the diversity of this nature, there is diversity of nature, there is different kind of nature you can find in different jivas. So, evam, this way, evam prakriti vai chitrat bhiddhate matayo ninam. Your opinion differ from me or my opinion differ from somebody, they are all. That's why in Mahabharata also we know, na so munir jasya matam na bhinyam. There is no such one single rishi whose opinion is not different from other rishis. Na so munir jasya matam na bhinyam, dharma satatam nihita guhayam, dharma satatam nihita guhayam, nihita guhayam, maha Janu Jenu Gatu Sapanthaha. Diversity quite natural. You cannot avoid. Even if you have your twin brothers, suppose you two take birth from the womb of mother, twin brother, twin girl, even you see nature different. Twin brother are looking same. But nature different. Follow. This way. So, evam prakriti vai chitrat bhiddhate matuyo ninam. This way, one, man, one jivatma differ from other. Or one man differ from other. Especially about bhajan, I can say. I like to apply this case in front of bhajan. It's more practical. Because he has written, Krishna speaking, Param parjena ke sanchit pasanna mato yo apare. Suppose Prabhupada speaking so nice Siddhanta Vichar, some of his disciples going to follow, like Sridhar Goswami Maharaj, Kesha Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Pumar, they don't like to get deviated even 0.0000, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1 millimeter. They are not deviated. They like to stay same line. They are same line. But yet, other you can find, they are deviated from. They are deviated. And maybe deviation 30%, 80%, 20%, 20%, 20%, 20%, 20 or 10%. It differs. It depends. It depend. So, param ke pasanna Some of them in the society or sampradaya are going to follow the same direction as shown by previous Acharyas, I mean Sautopantha, whereas other, they are going to show some extraordinary capacity. That's why this different kind of problem arises. So, evam prakriti vai chittat bhiddhate matayo ninam param parjena ke sanchit pasanda matayo pade. Some of them are going to follow the heartless heartless rules and regulation heartless their heart their activities their siddhanta vichar their activities they are all you can see of course if you are foolish number one who can understand if you have some common sense keep up guru they immediately understand these acharya doing this foolish number one he is making fool of others Totally is going to fool, make fool of others for Pratishla Puja Pratishta. No reality in it. But where is the whole public going? Why? What we can do? That is why yesterday I told one thing. That is why yesterday I told one thing very important. 
that what is the utility of Guru Parampara? I told, you will have to remember it. What is the utility of Guru Parampara? Utility of Guru Parampara lying with the fact that I am going to get the same teachings as given by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu or Bhagavan Sri Krishna Parampara. We are going to follow Bhagavad Parampara. Very much interested. Bhagavad Parampara are more important than Manto Parampara. But anyway, that day I was speaking in Devananda Gauriya Mat that Manto Parampara is also Bhagavad Parampara. Don't understand. Manto Parampara, if perfect, there is no, no disconnection. Same power coming out through Manto Parampara is okay. And after that, if there is breakage, then you will have to follow Bhagavad Parampara. But that doesn't mean Manto Parampara is not Bhagavad Parampara. Manto Parampara itself Bhagavad Parampara. And Bhagavad Parampara, Bhagavad Parampara. What I mean to say that Bhagavad Parampara is not Manto Parampara. But Manto Parampara must be Bhagavad Parampara. Mantra Parampara must be Bhagavad, Bhagavad without that, because mantra coming from whom? Bhagavad Parampara, Bhagavad. If there is no Bhagavad, what is the utility of? So it's magic. So Mantra Parampara is surely Bhagavad Parampara. It is also Bhagavad Parampara. But Bhagavad Parampara, Bhagavad Parampara, you know, no, no. Bhagavad Parampara can be. Mantra Parampara cannot be. Follow? Can. It's not a big deal. So this way, I told you, we like to get the same teachings of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu up to now. That's why we need Bhagavad Parampara. We like to get that. That is the utility of, of our Parampara system. Guru Parampara. If some Guru deviated from his track, then surely you cannot get power. I am not joking you. I am not joking with you. You can practically, you can survey. Practically. You can survey. They are doing everything. Tilak, Mala, they are chanting, everything they are doing. But that much power, there is no in them. Power is not there. Power like fire can come through Guru Parampara, provided you are going to follow Guru Parampara in intact way. Now one question is there, that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu teaching so many things. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is going to teach us so many things. But I can show you, if you go, if you want to understand directly what Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wanted to teach us, if you want to know directly from Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, you cannot do. Not possible for you. Because Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's activity or whatever Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is going to show us, it is not within your area. You cannot realize. So Guru Parampara, through Guru Parampara, we are going to learn why Chaitanya Mahaprabhu that time wanted to speak this way. Why Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wanted to uh, do this kind of thing? One or two examples I can give you, you can understand. One or two examples is sufficient. Follow. Like in Gundicha Mandir, like in Gundicha, when Gundi, when Gundicha Mandir cleaning going on, when Gundicha Mandir cleaning going on, at that time, one Leela was there, I have no time to discuss. I already discussed at the time of Gundicha Mandir. There Mahaprabhu is going to speak to Sarup Gosai particularly. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is going to speak to Sarup Gosai particularly that your, your Gauriya, that, that Gauriya, your Gauriya, your Gauriya doing this kind of thing, you see. Your Gauriya doing this kind of thing. Are, there are so many devotees. Why Mahaprabhu specifically going to uh, speak to 
Saurabh Gosai. All other devotees are there. You cannot make any meaning. So, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's Leela, directly we cannot understand. Our Guru Varga is going to teach us, well, the inner meaning, Mahaprabhu wanted to point out that Saurabh Gosai, Saurabh Gosai is the overall in charge of Gauriya society. Through this Leela, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wanted to show us that Saurabh Gosai is the overall in charge of this Gauriya society. Then, but we don't understand. Meaning of Gundicha Mandir Mahajan, why Mahaprabhu taking trouble? He is Bhagavan, going to clean all Mandir, water, uh, you know, boon, this, uh, why? Because we wanted to sit so us Cheto Darpana Marjanam, practically. Follow? You cannot understand. So many example, so many examples we can show you, through which you can understand that we need to depend upon our, we, we need to depend upon our Guru Parampara. We need to depend upon our Guru Parampara. If we are not going to depend upon our Guru Parampara, if Chaitanya Mahaprabhu directly standing, if Chaitanya Mahaprabhu directly standing in front of you or doing so many lila, you cannot make any head and tail. Nityananda Bhu Gaurang, you cannot understand. Not possible. So, this way I told you that Parampara system is very good. So, we have four authentic sampradaya approved in Shastra. Four authentic sampradaya, one I told, what is yesterday I told, Madhya Charja, Madhya Gauriya Madhya Sampradaya, Sri Sampradaya today Ramanu Charja, Nimbarka Charja, eh? and Vishnu Swami. They all have Ruddha Sampradaya, Sanak Sampradaya, Lakshi Sampradaya, and Brahma, Madhya Gauriya Sampradaya. Our sampraday, Brahma Madhya Gauri sampraday. This way we So today we are interested to discuss about the speciality of Srila great Ramanuja Charya. We are lucky that we are going to get this kind of exalted Acharyas, deputed by Bhagavan himself. Like Madhya Charya, Ramanuja Charya, Vishnu Swami, all they are coming by the desire of Bhagavan. By the desire of Bhagavan, they are coming time to time to teach us so many things. So Ramanu Shaju actually took birth in Mahabhutapuram, one place in South India, Madurai districts, there. Follow. They took birth and father, I don't like to discuss all in details about Siddhanta which I have to discuss, anyway I have to touch. Kesava Acharya, father, and Kanti Moti, mother. Kanti Moti, mother. Mother Kanti Moti and father Kesava Acharya, very good Brahman, very powerful. And when this boy took birth, some miracle, all surrounding situation is the body, by watching, everybody become mad. How possible? Not ordinary boy, very tall figure, very big boy. And immediately, maternal father, maternal uncle, Shaila Purno, I mean the brother of Kantimuti, immediately after getting information, coming to watch that boy. And after watching, Shaila Purna was stunned to see the all symptom of the body of that boy. And Shaila Purna was, you know, over sanguine. That boy is not ordinary boy. So Shaila Purna is not an ordinary man. Shaila Purna is an exalted devotee. He is a disciple of the great Jamuna Charja. You heard the name of Jamuna Charja, na? Great Jamuna Charja. About Jamuna Charja, we discuss, we can go mad. 
Dibba Suri, Dibba Suri, Jamanu Charju. So he is the main, very important, the main disciple of Jamuna Charju. By that time, Jamuna Charju was there already. So he, after watching the symptom, from heart he is speaking, this boy is not ordinary. I think he is Lakshman by the power of by the power of that Anantadev Lakshman is coming. This power I watch inside him. So according to that he is going to keep the name as Lakshman Deshik. Lakshman Deshik. And the boy and the boy growing up. And when the boy growing up, extraordinary. Is going to complete all education within very sh in a short period of time. Going to complete everything. After that, for further education, he wanted to approach some big acharya. But anyway, it is the arrangement of Bhagavan. Father and mother wanted to arrange arrange. Father and mother wanted to arrange marriage of that boy. Because on those days, father and mother used to arrange marriage very early. Girl maybe 8, 10, and boy 12 years, 15 years, within that day. So, forcefully, there was a mom. They forcefully arranged marriage. So, you are bound to marriage. A marriage was marriage. No internal connection. So, Lakshman Desik took decision, Lakshman Desik took decision, took decision to go for further education. Like Vedanta, this, that. At that time, there was one important Acharya of Vedanta, because that time, Vedanta means, if people used to think, that Vedanta means all Mayavad Vedanta. They used to think. Because Sankaracharya is a very, you know, early took birth. I yesterday told. So he was bound to approach Jadava Acharya, one Mayavad Acharya of Vedanta, to learn Vedanta. He wanted to go there. After going there, in Guru Kul, he used to stay because that was the system. To learn something, you will have to stay and do Guru Seva. And through Guru Shiva, you will have to take that lesson. In the meantime, what happens? The boy started taking education, Vedanta, Upanishad, everything. But in the meantime, one incident happened. I like to touch this incident to, so that you can understand that who is Lakshman Deshik. In the meantime, the daughter of Madurai, king, the daughter of Madurai king, there actually one ghost going to catch the daughter. And the marriage ceremony only three or four days due. Within three, four days, the girl going to be married. Eh? But in the meantime, ghost going to catch. When the ghost catching is dangerous situation. If if this news going, if this news going everywhere, then who can marry? Big problem can be. So he wanted to solve the problem very mutually. He wanted to call Jadava Charya. So would you please come and this is the situation you, you know, you have to drive out the ghost entering to my daughter. Hello. In the meantime, when Jadava Charya coming to take action, because he is knowing all mantra, everything, going to take action, then the ghost become very angry. The ghost becomes so angry, he likes to kill Jadava Charya. The ghost speaking, who is he? Who is he? Who is he? Going to give me treatment? I can kill him. He was one snack previous life. Ghost speaking. Jadava Charya won one snack previous life. By chance, one Vaishnav Uchista plate was thrown. Somehow he wanted to, uh, took that prasadam, uchista prasadam, so now taking this form of Brahman. Who is he? I can kill him. Then the king asking, then what to do? 
But if you give, if you can give the water wash of the leg of Lakshman Desik, his student, then I can go up. It's very derogatory. <laughs> Teacher is there, great Acharya. And a ghost speaking, I like to get the water wash of this small boy, uh, of the leg. So this was very dangerous situation. Jadavacharya was soaked. He was envious. Oh, then finally, water was of the lotus feet of that Lakshman Desi was given to the ghost. Ghost going to leave and gone. Ghost gone. The girl is saved. But in the meantime, this one kind of impression coming into the heart of Jadavacharya, you cannot forget. In the meantime, it was the system. You have to serve Gurudev. At present, uh, you can serve, you cannot serve. Or Gurudev can serve you. Is the system at present. At present, this is the system. Gurudev is going to serve. Then they can take disciple, foreign, can arrange marriage with foreign girl, this, that, they, they can. Ah, you can take. Gurudev can serve. Disciple. Disciple cannot serve. This is not the system at present. So, uh, I am not speaking, Popa speaking. Someday I can discuss this point. Popa speaking south, you know. Popa speaking this. So, this way, one day, uh, Lakshman Desi is going to massage well in the body of Jadavacharya. All body, Jadavacharya. And in the meantime, one man asking. Uh, the explanation of one word, kapyasanam. Tasso yatya, tasso yatha, tasso yatya, tasso yatha, kapyasanam, pundarikamiva akshini. Tasso yatha, kapyasam, Pundarika Miva Akshini. This Sanskrit word. One disciple wanted to, and student wanted to get the explanation. Jadavacharya is, you know, doing, and in the backside is a massaging well. In the meantime, Jadavacharya was speaking, well, kapi min, kapi min Sanskrit monkey. Kopi. Kopyasanam, kopi monkey, asan means backside. You are sitting now, it's called asan, backside of, of monkey. I know. Hello. Red is in color. So, Jadavacharya is going to explain this way. Kopi monkey, backside very red color, and the eyes, lotus eyes of Bhagavan is just like. The reddish color of the backside of monkey. Idiot number one. That time, Lakshman Desik, uh, Lakshman Desik, Lakshman Desik going to break down. That my Gurudev going to explain this way. And immediately from, from eyes, tears rolling down the cheeks and hot, you see. If you are going to set tears due to enjoyment, then your tears is cold. When out of grief you are going to set tears, very strong, then hot. Then hot tears drop in the backside. Then the Acharya is looking. Why you are crying? What happens? What happens to you? Bala, Acharya, you are going to explain this way that the Lotus like, you know, eyes of Bhagavan is just like the backside of a monkey. So what? It is the explanation by Acha, by Sankaracharya. You like to break him? Become very angry. You like to break the uh, uh, bichar of Sankaracharya? Or Adi Guru? What do you mean? You can explain? What do you know? Then Ramacharya is speaking, well, if you never mind, we can explain this way. What is that? Kong. Kong means water. Kong, Pivati, 
Kopi. Who is drinking water? From water, well, river, sun god. Sun god, na? Sun god, drinking water from everywhere. So, Ramachaja wanted to make this meaning. Kang Pibati Iti Kopi, Sun God, and As Datu Root, As, As means to express. Follow, they, you know, express the effulgence. So, this way, the meaning coming is very good. Lakshman Deshi wanted to say, Gurudev, if you can mean this way, that when sun god is going to put scorchy, hot in the water everywhere, drinking water, kapyasanam, and when sun rises, there is reddish color, all light coming, reddish power effulgent going there. So if we can compare that the lotus, lotus-like, lotus petal -like, lotus like lotus-like, Eyes of Bhagavan can be compared, can be compared with a lotus in full bloom, full bosom when the sun rises in the sky. Very nice meaning. By hearing this kind of, by hearing this kind of meaning, Jadvacharya has gone mad. Jadvacharya could realize. That boy in near future going to become an enemy of our sampradaya. Sankarija sampradaya. So anyway, it's dangerous. I have to find some solution. Either to kill that boy or do something. Follow. I have to arrange such a way so that I, I can kill or I can stop his mouth forever. One day from Tottariya Upanishad, Satyam, Jnanam, eh, Anantyam, Brahmam, this sloka. Jadvacharya wanted to explain. And Lakshman is going to explain very nice way. Repeatedly, repeatedly, Jadvacharya is defeated. He is feeling insulted by Lakshman Desi. Though we know Lakshman Deshi never want to insult anyone, but he think that way. He feel that I am insulted. This way he took decision to kill this boy, but not directly with knife. He wanted to kill that boy, but not directly with knife, because otherwise people can, uh, you know, criticize me, na. So better. Uh, Jadavacharya took decision, well, we can go to take birth in the, uh, you know, Elehavad, Ganga, Jamuna, Swaraswati, three river confluence, Mahatirtha, you know, Tithraj, you know, king of all Tirtha, Elehavad. So he took decision, while we are passing through the forest of Bindachal Parvat, while, because that time there was no train, no car, nothing. You have to go travel. Mahaprabhu also, five individuals. And this is also more previously. So they all student group, together with you know, Lakshman Desik, they are approaching towards you know, Elahabad, but through forest. Forest. Bindachal Parvat. And Jadavachar, you are planning how to kill that boy. Somehow we can leave this boy in some place, some such a place where tiger or lion can eat up. Follow. This is a planning. In the meantime, the this kind of planning, leakage of planning, this kind of leakage leakage of information, leakage. It was top my secret, but still leakage of information coming to Govinda. His brother, not direct brother, I mean the sister of mother, I mean, you know, cousin brother. After that, what happens? is going to, because that time Ramachuja was backside, there was torrential rain, 
and Jadvacharya was feeling big, big, big problem. So all scattered, all students some here, they are, they are taking shelter. Ramacharya, I mean, Lakshmandeshi was also back backside, and Govinda also purposely going backside. They couldn't notice and go to give information. Hey, they like to kill you. Run from here. As if I cannot walk. As if I cannot. Is purposely is making drama. Is going, you know, la you know, staying backside. They are advanced in the in the meet with you know Lakshman Singh. They plan to kill you in the forest. So better you run. Then Lakshman Singh started running. And Govinda, Jadavachar Jadhi, hey, why you are so late? Bakai, my problem in leg. You have seen. You have seen Lakshman Singh. I don't know where Lakshman Singh. I think Lakshman is already coming with you. You know, Lakshman is not coming. What happens? Lakshman is missing. Jadavacharya is thinking, then it is uh, it's very good. Maybe tiger or, you know, you know, lion. Finish. That's very good. Follow. In the meantime, what happens? Lakshman is running and running and running like mad. And finally, going to meet with one couple. They are a hunter, hunter couple. Hunter, you know, hunter. With tiger skin, everything, and Mataji's and, and that. Very low caste, very low caste. Black body with some bow and arrow, reddish color, eyes. So Lakshman is swaying in the forest, there is no support. So better I can follow them. Because in the forest nobody there. So better I can follow them. Finally, in the evening time, they are going to take rest under a big tree. Follow. Big tree. And Lakshman Deshi also taking rest. But the wife of that hunter become very thirsty. Going to dry. Then the hunter speaking, you have any information about any water source? Well, no. Well, I can search. He's going to search. And going to get some some water early in the morning, just before dawn. But there is no pot. So going to take Ramanusha, a very tall figure, big, big hand, going to take water and coming and giving to the Mataji's, I mean the wife, three times. Getting water and coming and giving, three times. Follow. After that, Ramanusha Jo suddenly discover that where is that hunter and wife? Cannot find, missing. After giving water, he was busy with something. He discovered that uh, the couple gone. Where gone? Immediately, Rama, I know, Lakshman Desi started hearing, shouting all around. Oh, what is the sound? Where from? So what is this place? Oh, you don't know, it's Baroda Charjo. Baroda Charjo? Eh? I'm coming to Baroda Charjo. Eh? Baroda Charjo, same bill. Oh, Bhagavan, take me from forest. How I'm coming here? Overnight. How possible? From forest, I'm here. But it is the arrangement of Bhagavan. Like the arrangement of Jagannath. Ramana Chaja wanted to install some special rules and regulations with Jagannath. But overnight, Ramana Chaja was thrown to Kurmachalam, 600 kilometers, 700 kilometers from Nilachal, Jagannath Puri. One night, Ramana Chaja wanted to install because Ramana Chaja has some influence. Huh? Even you see the Tilak of uh, Jagannath Mandir temple, is Ramana Chaja. So he wanted to make some special rules and regulations. Jagannath going to throw him with the best bedstead. With bedstead, where Ramanuja is sleeping, bedstead already gone to 600 kilometers away. Miracle. Kurma Khet, Kurma Chalam. Long distance. So Ramanuja could re realize that, well, Jagannath don't want I install some rules. Jagannath want to follow this kind of rules and regulation. So he so this way Lakshman Deshi was very happy. 
After that, what happened? After that, what happened? What happens? Jadavacharya somehow come back there and watching uh, Lakshman Singh. Oh, you are here. I thought you already died there in forest. Hey, you can come to teach, uh, take lesson to me. I can take special care to you. Lakshman Singh was very clever. Yes, yes, surely I am coming to take lesson. Where I can go? Actually, not going. Follow. This way, he wanted to kill. But one thing I forgot to tell, from very small boyhood, Ramanacharya, I mean Lakshman Deshik was, you know, very careful about Guru Vaishnava. Any Vaishnava is one to watch him. I like to pay Dandavat, I'm going to catch his lotus feet, bring, you can take prasadam in your house. It was a habit. From the very small boy, five years, five years, six years older, he used to invite. Oh, you can come to her house to take prasadam. And we to massage legs, everything. Kanchipurno, Kanchipurno was one disciple of Jamuna Charju. Kanchipurno. Kanchipurno was one disciple of Jamuna Charju, but from low caste. Very low caste. So what? Vaishnava is Haridas Thakur, Arogunaga, so what? That's not a big issue, na? But at present, what I was speaking yesterday, na? You go to Ramanuja Sambadaya, at present you go. Anywhere you go. You can consult. They can want to show their superiority regarding Brahman, predomin Brahman predominated society. But if they fight with me, I can show you that that Tirupan Alwar, Tirupan Alwar, he was Chandal. Chandal, you know? Chandal means those who are going to burn the dead body. So low caste. So Tirupan Alwar, who discovered who discover Ranganatham from forest, he was from a low caste. Very low caste. Chandal. They, any Ramanujaja, I, I speak you anywhere you go. Okay, they wanted to show their, you know, superiority. Oh, Brahman, this is like Chagal. Chagal and goat, you know. They are, uh, if I speak with them, they can, they can keep silent. They cannot speak anything. Dibba Suri, Tirupan Alvar, Shatokopo. You heard the name of Shatokopo? Never heard. When you can hear, life is very short. Shatokopo, was the incarnation of Vishakshan, Vaikuntha Parshat. From birth, he was crippled. You cannot speak anything. From by birth, he was so, you cannot speak anything. But he was the incarnation of, of Vishakshan. Up to 15, 16 years, not speaking anything with anyone, like uh, purposely. He used to stay in a cavity of a big tree. Cavity. Is somebody giving saprasada? Okay. But he is doing bhajan. Nobody knows. Like Jarabharat. Who can understand Jarabharat is an exalted devotee? Nobody can understand. Ah, dump and there. I use that. <laughs> Who can understand? Nobody can understand. Nah. This is uh, so. So. Actually, our Lakshman Desik used to love Guru Vaishnava from childhood. One day he is going to, he, because Kanchipurna used to go to, to pay Dandavad and to the lotus feet of Bharadraj every day. And while passing to their house, because that was the shortest route. So every day. So when that uh, Kanchipurno going, the small boy watching and paying Dandavat, Dandavat, every day. One day going, you can take prasadam here in our house. Well, I'm going to take prasadam. After prasadam is over, uh, you take rest a little bit. Then Kanchipurno going to take rest and uh, Lakshman Desi want to uh, massage the leg. And Kanchipurno, no, 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 no. No, 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 I cannot allow. I am from a very low caste. 
you are high Brahman. Lakshman Desik speaking, Lakshman Desik is Lakshman Desik speaking that Vaishnavas, Vaishnavas, they are always pure. They are from Brahman family, they are from Shudra family, they are from Chandal, not there. They are pure. Because in our uh, heredity, you know, Sri Sam, you know, they are already, you know, they are, uh, that Tirupan Alwar, he was Chandal. Then Kanchibun was smiling, not getting seva from anywhere, Kanchibun gone. One day, Lakshman Desi wanted to request you, give me mantra. I like to do bhajan. Well, I cannot give mantra. You are from a very high family. I cannot give mantra to you. Now nah, you can give mantra to me. You can. But Ramana Shaja, I mean Lakshman Desi want to get mantra. He like to avoid. He went to play some trick. Then finally speaking, well, my godmother. My godmother, Mahapurna, is uh, the appropriate guru for you. He is from a high family. Mahapurna. Where he is staying? Uh, he is staying there. Okay, I can go. He is going there. And can I, you can give me uh, Diksha, I like to. Okay. According to Pancharatik Vidhan, Lakshman Desik took initiation because Pancharatik Vidhan is applicable for all. For Brahman also, those who are not Brahman, for them Pancharatri. And some other rules and regulations were particularly pure Brahman in Brahman heredity. But Pancharatri Vidhan, speciality of Pancharatri Vidhan, Narat Pancharatri, is a speciality is that any kind of shortcoming, but if you are going to follow Pancharatri Vidhan, Diksha, you can cover up. You can cover up shortly. Pancharatri Vidhan. So Ramanujaja wanted to establish one Siddhanta Vichar in the very beginning. So he took Diksha, I know everything. After that, what happened? Uh, you know, Kanchipuram, one city, one not city and village. Village comes city, you know, there. Both Gurudev and Ram uh, and uh, Lakshman Desik there. Also. Because by that time Lakshman Desik was already married. And the wife of Lakshman Deshik, and the wife of Lakshman Deshik, Jamamba. Wife, name of, wife of Lakshman Deshik is Jamamba. She was very much in favor of Karma Kanda, Smartha. He was not in favor of pure devotion. No, not at all. Just opposite. Just opposite. By the desire of father, mother, Lakshman Desi was bound to marry, but he wanted to find out some way out so that he can cut the relation. But what to do? Finally, what happens? One day, because there in we also in Vrindavan there is one big well. All village men, we also from Sujanan temple, going to collect water because no water source. They are going to collect water. When the wife of Lakshman Desi collecting water, wife, by rope, this. At the same time, the wife of Gurudev, Guruma, also catching. By chance, some water from the pot of why, you know, this wife of Gurudev, by chance, go into the pot of, of Jamamba, I mean the wife of. She becomes so angry, she becomes so angry, started speaking all rubbish against, started speaking against that Guru Patni, wife of Gurudev. That immediately Guru, Guru Patni going to inform all in details to Guru, I mean husband. Husband though such incident cannot happen in future. So, so that this kind of incident not going to happen further, so let us go today without asking. Then they all, they're going to pack their luggage and gone from this without information to information of Lakshman Dashi don't know. After 
getting information why Gurudev gone so suddenly without information. Then Ramanuj, I mean Lakshman Deshi could get information from village man. This was the incident. Oh, that was the incident. Oh my God. It's a big offense. I will have to catch the lotus feet of Gurudev. Because why making mistake mean I am also involved? I am waiting and praying to Bhagavan. I can catch the lotus feet and beg for pardon. In the meantime, one very, very poor Brahman coming for begging. Mother, I need two bread. I am very hungry. Give me two bread. You know, speaking to Jamamba. I am in the wife of Lakshman Desi. Jamamba going to throw him out. God, get out from here. I am very hungry. Give me two bread. Son. Get out from here. So merciless. After that, that Brahman crying and going out, by chance he met with Lakshman Desi. Why are you crying? I go on there, that house. For what? To bake a uh, chapati this year, I'm very hungry. So, why? So, but that Mataji going to throw me out. Go outside. Really? Come on, come on, come on. Now he again go to the to that house. No, 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 I cannot go. Ah, hear me now. I have some plan. Again, you can go to that same house, same woman, same Mataji. No, 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 I don't. Hear me. You can speak to the lady, I am coming from your father's house. You can speak, then coming from your father's house, there is an arrangement going on, the marriage of your brother, so I have come to take you uh, to a village. You can speak. I, I, how I can speak like? Oh, oh, you can speak like for Bharadraj. For Bhagavan, you can speak like, no problem. You can go. Then going to Mataji, you drive me away. But I wanted to take you to your father's house. Why? Actually, your arrangement going on for the mother, uh, marriage of your brother. Really? Come, 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 sit. And giving so many chapati, milk, so many things well, up to this point. Follow. I, I come to take you. Oh, really? And in the meantime, Lakshman is what arrangement going on? Actually, you don't know. My brother's marriage ceremony going on. Oh, so you must go. So you cannot go. I can go after you. First go with all your ornament, all your new, new clothes, whatever you have. You take because day to day, after two hours, three hours, you can change your dress. No, you can take all. Yes, yes, you are right. You are going to take all ornaments and clothes, everything. After that, lady gone with that old Brahman. Then Ramanusha is going to Bharadraj and paying prostate dandavat, Prabhu, from today, I am only yours. From today, I am only yours. After that, took arrangement to take sannyas and at the bank of, at the bank of Ananta Saravar, at the bank of Ananta Saravar, remembering Jamuna Charjo, Jamuna Charjo photo, he took sannyas, Tidanda sannyas. Chiranda Sanyas, from then onward, big dhaka dhak preaching going on. Big, powerful. In the meantime, I forget to speak you one incident. By that time, by that time, Jamuna Charjo was alive. Jamuna Charjo, Jamuna Charjo started hearing, Jamuna Charjo started hearing all, you know, you know, name and fame of Lak, Lak, you know, Ramanu Shachu. I mean, Jamun, I mean, Lakshman Deshi. I am going back again. So, Jamuna Chaju thinking, Jamuna Chaju thinking, I am 100% sure that boy going to take the main part, vital part, as the leader, leading part in Vaishnav society. I'm sure about it. So somehow, I'll have to meet with that boy. I'll have to meet with that boy. How? The Jamuna Chajo coming, but Jamuna Chajo could see that boy with Jadava Chajo. I'm going long back. That time, Jamuna Chajo could not talk. So Jamuna Chajo planning how to, how to put some influence, 
how to put some influence so that the so that how to add, how to put some influence so that that Lakshman Deshi is bound to search me. I will try arrange. So Jamuna Church is going to arrange, uh, you know, Jamuna Church is going to arrange one disciple, Mahapurno, Purnacharya. You can go and sit every day in the temple, Stotra Ratnavali, one Stotra written by Jamuna Charjo. You cannot speak anything, particularly that at the time when Lakshman is coming to take, take darshan, you cannot speak anything. Go, you can sit in one place and go on reciting. Stotra Ratnavali. Don't speak anything. When Lakshman Desik paying Dandavad, day by day he is stunned. This kind of this kind of this kind of bars prayer, this kind of prayer in front of Baroda Charjo, who can do? He is not an ordinary man. Hey, you are reciting reciting who written? Who read? Who has written? The speaking actually is Jamuna Charjo. Can you take me in front of him? I like to go. I meet him. Well, yes. You like to go? Yes, I like to go. Then, Purna Charja going to take Lakshman Desik with him to meet with to, to meet with Jamuna Charja. Sri Rangna. But in the midway, they get, they get but in the midway but in the midway, somehow they get information, Jamuna Chaja already gone from this world. Oh my God, I am so unlucky. I like to meet with Jamuna Chaja. Just I am starting in the midway, get in for Jamuna Chaja, gone from this world. He started crying heavily. But still, he wanted to take darshan of Jamuna Chaja. Well, I can go. At least I can see the lotus feet of Jamuna Chaja. Well, he is going. Paying prostate, don't know what, touching, dust particle, taking, oh. But one miracle. One miracle. What is that? So many people are around. So many people. When Lakshman is going there, going to watch that the three finger, three finger, three finger is folded. Usually when man dying, actually, it's folded, and three finger, this. So Lakshman Desi could realize why three finger of this great exalted personality was folded. There must be some reason. By the kripa of Jamana Charjo, he could realize, he could realize and started speaking in front of public. Three most vital, three most vital desire of this great Mahapurush is not fulfilled. Not fulfilled. What is that? Then Lakshman Desi started speaking. First point, I promise that I can try to arrange all the population here, all around South Indian people. I can arrange them, I can arrange them and to follow the particular rule of submission, bhakti. And I can, I can do their sanskar. I can do their sanskar according to Pancharatik Vidhan. I promise. He Acharjo, Jamuna Acharjo, I promise that I, I, I can organize the whole society in the South Indian, this uh, foolish people. I can arrange them to follow particular system of Pancharatik Vidhan. I can arrange them their submissive attitude, submission. Then one finger open automatically. Another two finger folded. Then going to second, I going to promise that, that I can that I can arrange all Tata Siddhanta I can collect and I can write I can write Basha. 
commentary on Vedanta, I can write. I promise. Touching, Jamani Shajapur. Then that second finger open. Only one finger. Third, I promise by touching this transcendental body that I can make one encyclopedia, dictionary, Shabdakosh, to explain all each and every word written by Parasar Rishi. Parasar. You heard the name Parasar. Parasar Rishi, who wrote Vishnu Puran. So, Lakshman is speaking, Vishnu Puran, Vishnu Puran written by Vishnu by Parasar, Parasar Rishi. I can make so I, I can make on a, all each and every word they used. I can make so all detail information. Follow. I can come. Propat Abhirbhav Tithi coming now. I can explain how some. Great, exalted, you know, scholar, he wrote one letter to Prabhupada. I think I am the, I am the, you know, topmost, you know, personality in language, language department of Calcutta University. But please send me dictionary. I can explain that day, not today. So, after that, all fingers free. Jamuna Charjos, all last, you know, samadhi, everything done. So, after that I told already that how initiation, everything and sannyas done. And from then onward, by the desire of Jamuna Charja, he started preaching heavily. At the same time, he is very aware of the fact, very alert about three kind of promise done in front of the body of Jamuna Charja. Is very thinking how to fulfill. I should not forget. But in the meantime, you know, Kanchipurno speaking, if you like to get all detailed information of the mantra mystery, mystery of mantra, if you like to get all details about the mystery of mantra, I mean, Jadavachar, from Jadavachar, you know, Kanchipurno took. Kanchipurno, Kanchipurno, and uh, you know, Purna Charjo, they are Godbadan, na? Godbadan, na? From whom? A, and, I'm not, Ramana Charjo, I mean, he took Diksha, na? Lakshman Desi. So now they are discussing where from I can get the mystery of mantra? Who can speak? You know? I know, but not so in details. Actually, this is specially given to Goshtapurno, our Godbadan. Goshtapurno? Yes. Goshtapurno was given the mystery of mantra by Jamuna Charju. So, well, when I can meet Goshtapurno? Uh, there he is staying there. So, I must go and catch his lotus feet. Goshtapurno? Knowing the a special mystery of mantra all given by Jamuna Charju to him. So, I must go and catch. He is going to catch lotus feet. Give me, give me mantra. Eighteen, eighteen times. 18 times he was rejected. He was treated 18 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 18 times he was rejected. Today I have no time. No, I cannot give you. I can test you. Please. 18 times. After, after 18, 18 times over, after 18 times of testing over, Goshtapurna was ready to give mantra, provided there is one condition there. Provided you can follow one condition. What is that? You cannot give this mantra to anybody. You have to promise. Well, after that, he is going to get all the mystery of mantra, so many things. Jamana Chaja keep going to keep this treasure to Gostapurna. He is going to collect everything. Some special mantra also. also. And after receiving that mantra, when, when our, you know, this uh, Ramanuja Charjo, Ramanuja Charjo, after getting this all, everything, all treasure, coming to the, to the city, Kanchipuram, 
and there in front of 74 people in a hall. 74 people close the door and he's sitting, Ramachaja, going to speak the mantra loudly. Ah, you take mantra in front of 74 people. Going to give mantra. After getting the information, Gostupurna was so angry. Eh? You can go to hell. I already told you, don't speak to anybody. Ramachaja with four. Ramanachaja with folded hands singing. Gurudev, if I am a very useless man, if I am going to hell, it's good. But at least I can save 74 people, I, I save them. They can go to, you know, Vaikuntha. After hearing the mood, after hearing the mood of Ramanuja Charjo, he was a little bit afraid. Oh, his mood is not bad. He... Gurudev, what wrong in it? Gurudev, what wrong in it? Useless man like me going to hell. And at the same time, if I can save so many people, they can go to Vaikuntha. I am ready to go to hell, okay? If you... Then Gurudev become very happy. Oh, the mood of... The mood of Ramachaja is not bad. So, anyway, so he wanted to... He wanted to arrange the... He wanted to arrange the initiation of his own son. He wanted to arrange the initiation of his own son, Gurudev, from Ramanachaja. In the meantime, Ramanachaja, uh, you should remember, when Ramanachaja, you should remember that when Ramanachaja started giving initiation, first initiation received by whom? This is by whom? Kuresh. Second, the mother of Jadava Acharya, that wicked Acharya. You know, that idiot, his mother. So, first of all, Kuresh took initiation. After that, that, you know, lady. After that, the Govinda, I mean, cousin, he took. After that, Jadava Acharya also. Changed his mood. He wanted to take shelter onto a lotus feet of Ramanujaja. You please, you best to keep on me. Follow. So he was initiated by Ramanujaja. No envious attitude. Ramanujaja giving initiation. Finally, he took sannyas also. I started with it. So it is the power of big, big exalted person. They can change even, even our. Rasikananda, he was successful to change one mad elephant. So what to speak about human being? But my condition is more worse than one element, an animal. This is the condition. This way, Jadvacharya was also initiated. But in the meantime, the name and fame, name and fame of Ramanujajya spreading so rapidly that everybody, some chill, you know, some people, they like to kill. They wanted to apply, they wanted to apply medicine in food, in the name of Prasadam, in Charnamitra, Charnamitra also. One day Ramanujajya is going to take Charnamitra directly from Bhagavan, but one lady is going to pinch in his leg. Pinch one lady. I mean the wife of the man who applied poison. She going to, in the name of pain, pinch in the world. Then Namashajo immediately could realize, why is she, the lady going to pinch? So he stopped taking Charnamita. Even in Prasadam, had to feel. I already started with fine. So day by day, the name on fame of Jamnaj, I mean, Ramanachaja spreading so rapidly that so many groups, Mayavadi and all other groups, they are very much angry, anxious, they like to kill him. Follow. So Krimi Kantha, one very wicked king of South India, one place, king, Krimi Kantha, he going to, he wanted, he is actually Shaiva. 
He is the follower of Sivji Maharaj. He wanted to convert, he wanted to convert Ramanushaja from Vaishnavism to Saivaism. But when Kures got information that Ramanushaja, my Gurudev, is being and uh, going to be invited by Kimikanta. Then Kure speaking, well, whom you want? But well, I want Ramanushaju. I am Ramanushaju. Oh, then you are your king calling you. In the name of Gurudev, Kure is going. In the dress of Ramanushaju, sannyas base. By that time, Kure was not sannyas. He's going, well, who are you? Well, my name is Ramanushaju. Uh, so you will have to sit for, you know, for Shastriya judgment. Our Pandit there and you. Well, have started. And Kure is going to defeat him. But Krimikanta was very envious. You will have to change your decision. You will have to change your decision, otherwise we can kill you. Okay, you can kill me. You can kill me, but I cannot change my decision. Finally, Krimikantha is going to eradicate the two eyes of, of Kuresh. Oh, blood coming out. Then by the help of one prayer, he was thrown outside the road. By the help of one beggar, he could reach up to Guru Padma. Guru Padma was watching, what happens, Kuresh? But this is the condition. Oh, my son is going to embrace him. Come on with me in front of Bharat Raj. In front of Bharat Raj, you can come. Say, in front of Bharat Raj, Ramanuja is speaking, Prabhu, to protect your interest, my son, now blind. So, Prabhu, it is your duty. You have so many seva. Then, Bharat Raj, blessing. Then, Kure is going to get, develop new eyes. More powerful eyes than supernatural eyes by the help of which you can pass, present, future. Bharata is blessed. Then, in the meantime, Ramanuchaju thinking, well, I will have to take a uh, step because I, it was my three uh, outstanding duty. I promise in front of you. So, he started initiating people, going to show them the way of Saranagati. And Ramanujaja told, wrote one book, Prapanna Jivanamritam. One very important book. Prapanna Jivanamritam, which was published by our Siddhar Goswami Maharaj. And my Guru Maharaj used to speak to me. Baba, if you like to learn so many things about Bhakti, you can read. Prapanya, I will have to search where I keep this book. I have. Prapanya Jivanamitam. So he started. First responsibility, first promise. Second promise, Vedanta, how to. Then he wanted to arrange Bodhayan Basya. Commentary by Bodhayan on the basis of which Ramanuchajo wanted to write very nicely. Because Ramanuchajo Siddhanta is. is Vishishtat Daitavad. Yesterday I told Madhvacharjo, Madhvacharjo is Shuddha Daitavad. Shuddha Daitavad. And Ramanacharjo is Vishishtat Daitavad. So I can discuss something about it, okay? So in the meantime, Ramanacharjo got information that they are going to keep that book, I mean, Manas, I mean, writings of Bodhan Basa escaped there in Kashmir, you know, North India, Himalayan place, Sharada Pit of Sankaracharya. So, with Kuras, he started moving and reaching that Sharada Pit, wanted to take rest there in the night time. They allow him, okay, you can take rest. Uh, then uh, then Ramanuchaj was asking, could you please give any information about the Buddha and Basha? I heard this you know, manuscript is there with you. No, 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 no manuscript there. The straight away feel no. But it is there. Mayavadi, 
they are very clever, they don't like to. I, I just like to see and give you back. No, no basa there. But I heard Bodhan Basu is there with you in your library. We say no. Then Ramanisha just keep silence, no, don't speaking and thinking and praying to Bhagavan what to do. I come up to this path, long distance, thousands of kilometers. Now I can go back empty hand. So in the meantime, Saroda Pit, night time, Saroda Devi, Saroda Pit. One demigod, Saroda. She is coming with the Basha and going to hand over in front of Jamanachar. Uh, I mean, in front of Ramana. You take and go away from here. You take and go away from here. And in some place we find information Nishingadev himself gave. Anyway, whatever it is, we are not bothered about that. Whatever it may be. So, Ramanusha Jo in the night time taking the book and with jag and with you know kures running, running, running. Running, running, ooh, running. One one day crossing hundreds of kilometers. Running. Finally, the Mayavadi they discover our Bodhan Basa missing. Oh that man must have taken away. So they engage one powerful man, three, four men, payment, very powerful, hilly man, hilly place they are saying, very powerful man, three or four. You run, as per your capacity, we can pay heavy amount, go and snatch, because hilly place, where they can fly, same way. They are flying, long, long, within one month or two months, you know, one month ago. They are finally going to catch and fight with them. Ramanusha is not fighting. Going to snatch away Buddha and Vasa from. Ramanusha is then thinking, my God, Bhagavan, according to your keeper, I am getting Buddha and Vasa. I was supposed to write the commentary, but not from. He started shedding tears. Kura speaking, Gurudev, don't worry. Wow, don't worry, man. But I memorize. Uh, you memorize? Well, yes. Night time you are taking rest. I memorize all. Whole, whole. Eh? You memorize. Uh, I can write intact with dot, full stop, quotation, all. Oh, really? Within within four or five days I can do. <laughs> really so? Curious writing in detail. As if the picture taken of the book. As if the picture taken of the book. Or more. We are taking picture of the book, na, paper, intact. Ramanushaji was so happy, so happy, so happy, bless him. On the basis of that, Bodhan Bhasya, Sri Bhasya, Sri Sampadaya Bhasya, written by Ramanushaji was completed. This way, Ramanushaji completed so many books, you know, on Upanishad, Bhashya, so many things he wrote. So many things he wrote. He was successful to fulfill the desire of the great Alwar and uh, Dibba Shuri, not Alwar, Dibba Shuri, Jamuna Charja. Successful. So, what Jamuna Charja wanted to give us, if we discuss, then you can understand. With this brain, we cannot understand. <laughs> Our block-headed, we are. What Ramanishaj wanted to give us, to understand, then you will have to go deep into the philosophy. Ramanishaj was a very, very important personality at that time, because our Madhvacharya came after. Follow. So Ramanishaj, so powerful, almost going to destroy all Mayavad field. So powerful. You can see the picture around you, so tall figure like this. Big, big tilak. Especially we can see in the Natya Mandir of Sri Chaitanya Gurimat, Calcutta, Paramita Madhu Gusimara here. When I go to Natya Mandir, watch, I am looking at them. Madhya Shacho, this, that, I am watching. But at present, this kind of picture is rare. Where we can get, we like to 
four Acharya we like to say, very nice. But where we can get the original picture anyway. So, we like to discuss something about Vishishta Daita Bhav. The basic thing, because detailed information, if I like to discuss, you can catch, cannot catch. Anyway, so what is the speciality of Vishishta Daita Bhav? What is the worshipable object of Ramanacharya? Worshipable object of Ramanacharya is Lakshmi Narayan. Lakshmi Narayan, actually. So anyway, so Ramanacharya wanted to say that Brahma is one and unique. Try to understand Siddha, Jist, Siddhanta Vishal. Ramanacharya wanted to see Pishishta Daitavad. Pishishta means speciality of that Adaitavad. What is that? Ramanacharya speaking, Brahma is one and unique. Okay. But at the same time, Brahma, Chit, Achit, and Brahma. Try to synopsis, very. Chit, Chit means Chinmoy. I mean all Jiva, Jagat. Chinmoy, Jiva. So Chit, Achit, Achit means matter. All Chit, Achit, non different from Brahma. I mean they are all coming from Brahma. Brahma is the source of. So, if Brahma is true, then this matter and, I mean, this Chetan, Achetan and Brahma simply, simultaneously all eternally present. But creation sometimes vanish from our eyes and sometimes manifest. This much different. Ramanacharya is speaking like a spider, when you create everything, after that dial in, after that, I'm going to you know, withdraw all the network. Ramachar is giving the same example. So, they are non-different from Brahma. Brahma is the absolute truth. So, all, all Chidatma, Chit and Achit, they are, at the same time, they are also eternally present. They are there. Sometimes creation we can see, sometimes we can see withdrawn this much. Ramanacharya wanted to say, this material world, Ramanacharya wanted to say, this material world and all Chidatma, whatever form it is, maybe in the form of human being, maybe in the form of animal, whatever, all Chidatma, whatever form. Ramanacharya speaking, it is a, is a speciality manifestation. It is the special Vishishta, special manifestation of Brahma. Brahma, when do you express in this form? Really so? Brahma coming. Though we know, as per our Siddhanta, we know this material world is the expression of Maya. But in one sense, if Madhacharya, uh, Ramanacharya is speaking this way, Maya is also Maya from where from coming? Maya also coming from Bhagavan. Shakti. Shakti, Shakti, Matur, Avet, Shakti, Man, Shakti, Man, and Shakti, non different Prabhupada. Bhagavan is going to reserve all energy. So, Shakti, manifestation of Shakti, and Shakti and Shakti, Man, non different. So, in this way, if we discuss, it is not wrong. Ramacha speaking, all the manifestation of the material world. All these manifestation of the material world and all jiva, their sarir, their body, everything is manifested of Brahma. In one sense, it's not wrong. Brahma, from Brahma, everything coming. From Brahma. But what Mayavadi is going to explain, it is totally objectionable. We can never accept this. What Mayavadi speaks, someday I can discuss. What Mayavadi want to speak. There, Argument we are less interested to see. And Ramanacharya wanted to express Shakti Tattva. Ramanacharya not going to say like Mayavadi. Ramanacharya Shakti Tattva also. Brahma has some Shakti. So going to express. It's one special, 
special manifest special manifestation uh, of the you know of Brahma. This can be said. No wrong in it. So Ramanujaji anyway going to confess Sakti Tattva. It's very vital. So when Mahaprabhu came, Mahaprabhu wanted to reconcile. Mahaprabhu wanted to reconcile all four sampradaya. They have some shortcoming, man has some shortage. If Achinta Vedavet going to add with, you know, Madhvacharya, it takes a complete form. If Achinta Vedavet Tattva going to touch Ramanacharya, you know, it's same like, you know, Vishnu Swami and Nimbarka all. So Mahaprabhu, as Paratpara Kilishwar wanted to give the final touch, but all sampradaya, then you can find all harmony. Otherwise, some jig jag. Follow. So, this way, we pray unto the lotus feet of Srila Ramanushajya to give us power because Ramanushajya is not ordinary. Ram Anujo Acharya. Ram Anujo Acharya, if the name we feel like to split up, Ram Anujo Acharya. In Sanskrit, if you split up, Ram Anujo, Ram plus Anujo plus Acharya. What does it mean? Ram means Ramchandra, Anujo means younger brother, Lakshman, Ram Anujo, Acharya is acting as it. So Lakshman from Lakshman, from Lakshman, Ramanacharya coming. That's why the name of Ramanacharya is Ram plus Anujo, Anujo means younger. Ram plus Anuja plus Acharya. So we like to pray unto a lotus feet of Ramanushajya to best to keep on us. We love him very much, especially our Acharya, big, big Acharya, Prabhupada, Bhaktivinoda Thakur. They used to honor four Acharya at the same time. Who not? Everybody. Our Madhu Goswami Maharaj, you can go to Puri, four Acharya. Or you can go to Chaitanya Mahat, four Acharya. So, our Acharya, our Prabhupada Bhakti are going to honor, so we have to pay honor automatically. We are going to honor them, to get kipa from them. Anyway, so you can remember the sloka as I started with. Don't forget to see all the dirty condition of this society. If you have your power, if you have taken milk from the breast of your mother, you try to do bhajan. Why you are going to find four? Evam prakriti bhai chitrad vidyate matayo ninam param parjena ke sanchit param parjena ke sanchit pasanna matayo apare vancha kalpataru se ke pasin de bhaj patitanam pavana bho vasna bhyo namo namo. So, why Ramunu Jacharya accepted so foolish guru? Huh? Why Ramunu Jacharya accepted so foolish guru? Huh? So? No, 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 no. No, no, no. He was not guru for learning Vedanta because that time it was the system. Ramachajo expressing man, human lila, na? He thought he is a famous Vedanta Acharya, I can go. He is not guru. He took initiation from, I already told, na? Purna Acharya. So it's not good. It's okay. It's a, they are manifesting this kind of lila. Like Prabhupada. Uh, approaching Gaurkishar Baba, 18 times he was rejected. They Leela, one kind of. So, human Leela, no? they are doing. So, next Harikatha, what you arrange? 